Hey YouTube, um, I've got a bunch of feedback and requests for an old video that I did a while ago, basically on this uh, Burnsomatic torch. So basically, what you know, what's the uh, easy way to start it up, and what did I do to uh, make it really easy? So one of the first things I do, well, make it easy, and you know, what are the turns? Uh, I remember someone asking, but um, so basically, what you know the the key thing with this this little cheap set which a lot of times again like I said in my old video I just needed to loosen bolts I don't really need to uh, cut anything with I don't do any brazing so it's just uh, loosen bolts so it's cheap and inexpensive the downside is it's cheap and inexpensive and not very controllable and tough to set up if you don't know the little trick plus the other thing I've learned is you really can't use it outside um, like it just doesn't like the wind. It gets blown out really, really easy. So I'll just show you, here's my little trick on uh, how I set it up and how I get it started. So basically one little upgrade that, you know, I did since the last video is I put these marks right on. So these are all tight. I put them right on my uh, the knob. So you know how much you're turning it. So you, you, because there's no pressure gauge, you have no, um, sense of how much pressure or flow or anything so this is a good reference so basically um what i'm going to do here is let me uh, set up the camera and then i'll uh i'll start the whole process so give me all right second. so what i'm going to do is i'm going to uh you always start off with the map first and then you go oxygen uh just like with any uh oxy assembling setup so what I'm going to do is, um, like I said, I put these at 12 o'clock, pretty much 12 o'clock or, you know, a, an easy reference point. So basically on the map, you basically uh, open it up. So it's at 12 o'clock now. You open it up to roughly, um, say, 11, 10, 11 o'clock. Um, but then you do an adjustment based on the flame uh, length. So let's, let's go ahead and do that. So let me open this up to about 11 o'clock, 10 o'clock, and then start the flame. sparker there so as you can see this flame is a little too long so I'm gonna turn it down slightly so that blue blue touches the tip right there just a little bit you, know, you want it as big of a flame so let me back this up a little bit you want as big of a flame as you can get without it jumping from that from that right there so you want the blue flame touching that so we're good right about there so then the oxygen let me uh, crank this up a little bit so you can see so then the oxygen gets adjusted to about like one and three quarters turn that's basically right about what you want um, and then you slowly ease into it so it's like one and three quarters or maybe a little bit less than one and three quarters because that's right when it takes off so let's turn that so let's uh, as you can see, here's the line. So let's turn. Turn it one, a quarter, and a half. And what you want to do is right, you want to ease into one and three quarters. And the reason is, I think, what I've learned is um, the oxygen slowly f flows through. It just slowly comes through and then, you know, tends to build up. And I think that's why it tends to pop. So it's you need to slowly ease it in. So I'm getting slowly over to one and three quarters. See, it's starting to, starting to change right there. There you have it. And then you can adjust it however, depending on what, how much heat you want. And all that. So, and you can then pull with, you know, whether you want to do a little more map, a little bit less map, a little more oxygen. But basically, that's, that's the basic difference. So, we're one and three quarters. It might be different on each one of your uh, little setups because, you know, these things are not precision. So, it's just a matter of finding out where, um, you know, where that is. As you can see, it slowly, even though I did it, it slowly creeps up. So, I'm going to turn it down a little bit. So, but that's it guys, it's really that easy. So you just gotta take your time, um, and that's it. Thanks for watching, please uh, like and subscribe. Talk to you soon.